All right, back at it the next day. Um, I'm in a new area I've never been to. I just had a bite and missed them, so. Um, I know there's reds here, I just gotta, my dad fishes around here. I never really fished this area. The spot I wanted to go to, I can't get to. It's, it's uh, way too rough to get out there. So, just try this out. Pretty sure there's some bass here too. day I mean I haven't seen a calm day in like a year it's insane it's like yesterday I started off with the same fish this size Got a gulp on my chatterbait, which looks really good. This true gulp. Another little one. Little baby. Little baby. Ripped my tail already, but it's all right. Chatterbait. Little red. Keep on working them. Can't turn around, just put it in reverse and go backwards. That's all you gotta do. It's shallow too, I'm kicking up mud even with it trimmed up all the way. Not all the way, but basically. Yo, check me out. Catching a bass with the reds, baby. You love to see that. Ow, you love to see that too. That was a good hit. Watch him suck it down. Pretty awesome. This wind, oh my, get off the troll motor for 0.2 seconds and it's over. Oh baby. Oh, baby. It's a good red. Net him in the net that's not open as usual because, oh, get up here, don't do it to me. It's not as big as I thought, but dang it, I'll take him. He looks big in the water. Like a sturgeon under the water for some reason. The wind's pushing me all through this. Yeah, stop it. Okay, man. You ripped my gulp. Are you proud of yourself?
happy, happy little fella at this point. I'm gonna keep it rolling. I'm feeling them. Probably won't get another bite, but I'm feeling them. I'm feeling them. I'm freaking feeling these fish. It was a perfect example of what I was saying. Like when you pause it, all I did was pause the lure, hit the bottom. I went to go lift it up, and it was a, uh, and it was just heavy. I didn't feel the bite. I just slurped it off the bottom, slurping and derping. Oh, I love the chatterbait. With this grass, it'd be so hard to fish any other bait and present it properly. Chatterbait just comes through it. You give it a pop and it comes right out the grass. I'm telling you, that drives them. It drives them insane. And the added bonus with the gulp is they'll hold on to it when they grab it. I mean, I was late on that fish. I didn't know when he hit it. I just felt the uh, weight of him. All I did was pause it, lift. It was heavy, you know, and I just set the hook. So... And I've done studies with gulp, like my own personal way of doing it. Oh, you mother freaker. Stop, boat. What was I saying? Oh, I've done studies with gulp where I'm fishing and there's, you know, there's a hot bite, right? I'm on red, stacked up in the wintertime, every cast. I've uh, fished with the, with, you know, like a matrix shad. They'll hit it but they spit it out after a, a couple seconds. They won't hold it. Gulp, when they hit it, I've let them hold it for up to like 45 seconds. They don't even like, and they didn't swallow it. It was just in their mouth, but they, they'll hold on to this taste or whatever's on it. They love it. It really, it really is amazing. I just wish gulp was durable, man. Like I said, putting it on ice is the best way to get more out of it. But yeah, they're not, they don't hold up. That's the only problem with them. I guess they're not in here. Come on. Time for a new gulp already. And I'm not practicing what I'm preaching because I'm lazy. I'm not putting them on ice. <laughs> I don't feel like digging in there every time. When I go fishing, man, I just, I can't, I can't waste any time. I feel like I need to take advantage of every second I'm out here. I don't know. Fish it. Get out here. I don't feel like having you rip my tail, punk. Okay. Be scared to pop the heck out of this thing while you're uh, reeling it. I like to, uh, like, I like to cast it out, right? Reel it off the bank real slow at first, and then I give it a pop, pop, and then kill it, and then start it up again. And a lot of times, man, they can't help that. It, you can get a reaction bite out of it, because not every fish is going to hit you as this bait comes by. You know, they'll pass it up. I've seen it happen a million times. So pop, pop, kill it. Start it back up, pop, pop real slow pop out kill it and just you know just do that 
change it up, make it look like, you know, it's, it's freaking out basically. But you don't want to sit there and just pop it like a crazy person. Just smooth retrieve, pop, pop, stop, start up, pop, 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 and then, you know, just different things. Find out what they want. the water oh my god I thought I was in grass <laughs> that was awesome oh yeah got away. I don't even know if you're going to keep anyway. Good thing I didn't unhook you and do that. Oh, 17 and a half. That sucker was on it instantly. All right, got me one. It's been a while. I, uh, I got lost in the marsh. I was on the phone trying to figure out how to get home. Or not home, but get back. I was like, man, where the heck am I? He is not a keeper. 17 and a half, like they're all the same size, these little ones. But, man, got lost and I was like, okay, where the heck am I? Had to talk, my, talk to my dad to get, so he can, he knows this area, he knows all these areas. And uh, I guess I should pay more attention when we're, when we're fishing. Because, man, it's easy to get lost. It all looks the same. There he is. There he is. He dumped it. It's a good one. Good one. Oh man, he hit it so good. So good. Beautiful red, man. Beautiful. Beautiful hit as well. Nice hit, thumped the heck out of it. And um, yeah, it's my third keeper. Caught a few rat reds, but that's a good one. Go ahead and change out my batteries and get reset up and uh, I'll be. it and it's heavy and I was like ah oh. and the next thing I know it's swimming right at me. You gotta measure him I mean 
Just under. Heck yeah, man. That was awesome. He held it. I'm not going to say it was the gulp, but I'm going to say it was probably the gulp. So. Oh. 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 I paused it, dude, and I went to go fix the trolling motor, and he was on. And he was on it, and then I got this bad boy. Oh. It. That's what I get for trying to finesse him. That's two keepers I just lost back to back. Come on. Come on. Barely hooked too. But he's little, so I'll catch him. I'll catch the little ones. Let the big ones go. Nice guy. He's too little anyway. Pooping on a crab leg. Not a little one. Still pretty. Blue tail. It slowed up out here. It was hot. I was getting some bites for a minute. Little guy. Put him on the jig. Right here by this point. He was on it when it hit the water. I'm just letting the wind blow me around. Use up. I don't have much battery left. So, or yeah, I don't have any trolling motor battery left. So I'm just uh, going with the wind basically. A lot of bait in here too. Oh, big gar came up behind me. Had a little bite up there. Felt weird, weird. There he is. Easy. Maybe more. 